Okay, I am in Auckland, New Zealand. I am about to do the sky jump. And that means I'm gonna jump out of this building like bungee. And I think bungee was invented in New Zealand, so I trust these people to, that they're gonna know what they're doing. And one of the reasons I'm so excited about this is I was just watching David Letterman and Zachary Kinto, who plays Spock in the new Star Trek movie, just did this. He said that he was just sitting in his hotel, one of these hotels, doing an interview, and he just saw bodies falling out the, and he thought somebody, you know, had chosen to end it at all, but it turns out people were doing the sky jump, and so he decided he had to do it, and so I'm going to be getting my spot on today, and uh, I'll let you know how it goes. Okay, if I look like a superhero, it's because I kind of am. I just jumped off the Sky Tower in Auckland, New Zealand. It's part of the Sky Jump, and um, I, I conquered my fear. And I will tell you, I was a little nervous at the very top, like when it's time to go. I was maybe going to not do it, and, uh, but I did it. And I was a little unnerved standing up there because they were playing classic rock, and the song that was on was Break Down. It doesn't make you feel invincible, does it? And then the thing that's really unnerving is the wire that's, there's a coil as it's going down, so when the person would jump before you, you would hear the sound of this thing going like that. And then it would be really loud, and it would get faster, 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 and faster. And it was the sound of death, frankly. But um, it wasn't really, but that's what it sounded like. So I blocked that out, I got up there, I focused, and I did the jump. And I was told that my jump was very pretty. So we will see on the video. Um, I think it's on a scale of one to 10 gay. I think it's gonna be like an eight, eight and a half. We're about to watch the video of myself um, jumping. I was told it was quite graceful. Now, around about this point, the guy Andy, he said, are you nervous? And I said, I'm a little nervous. And I said, I'm just gonna try to stay in the moment and trust the experts. And he said, that's a good idea. Too bad I don't, don't know where they are. So he was being a little cheeky, but uh, it was good. Um, it started to rain a little, so you might see some drops on the lens. Here I'm freaking out because my, um, the, the bar was wet and I didn't know what that meant. So go ahead and film it on there and I'll critique. Um, okay. Really okay, I'll... Whoa, there I go. I'm quite, quite graceful. Yeah. And now I'm waving. Look at the pointed legs in the back. Dance background. Uh, you could tell I used to be a cruise ship dancer. All paying off. My, I totally got the giggles at the bottom. I was laughing so hard when I landed. I don't know why. I think it's just the release of the energy, and um, also my landing. I didn't. I was too busy getting like this that I forgot to bring my legs underneath and sort of land properly. But for a first time out, it was pretty great and I loved it. Okay, I am in the observation deck of the Sky Tower in Auckland, New Zealand. This is the building I jumped off yesterday. I just enjoyed a flat white, which is my favorite coffee drink in New Zealand. It's espresso with milk and some cream and sometimes a heart on top depending on the server. I realize now that I'm up here two of the reasons I was able to do this jump and not die. It's because they put little reminders on the way down of why you should go on living. For example, there's a roof that just has the words Mexican food written on the top of it right as you're going down and I thought I can't have a heart attack. I love Mexican food too much. And if that weren't enough, there's also a billboard for the new Tom Hanks movie. And so I'm thinking, I could die, but if I do that, I won't be able to see Tom Hanks in Angels and Demons. These Kiwis think of everything, is my point. That was me yesterday. So if you ever come to Auckland, New Zealand, it's a great way to spend a few hours. It's right in the heart of the city. You get an amazing view, and you get to feel like a superhero.